Hi everyone, my name is Claudia and I'm here with TV Stuff Reviews and today I'm going to be reviewing the Tac Zoom. So Tac Zoom is a Bell Howell product and basically what you do is you attach your Tac Zoom to your phone and it turns it into a telephoto lens and you can zoom up to 10 times the amount that your phone could do on its own. It says it's great for sporting events, concerts, sightseeing and more. And the great thing about this is if you bring this along, it's very it's tiny, it's compact, you can put it in your backpack or your purse even, and you don't have to carry around like a DSLR if that's too much for you. I'm pretty sure I got the like variety pack, so mine comes with the telephoto lens, which is the zoom lens, um, a fisheye lens, and a macro wide lens. Um, so I'm really excited about this. And it also came with two lens holders. So this is what the packaging looks like. I have yet to open it. I'm very excited to open this with you guys and show you guys how it works. I have really high hopes for this. This is the telephoto lens. Um, I don't know how it attaches to my phone quite yet, but we're gonna figure that out. And then these are the two other lenses that it came with. Again, I'm not sure which is which. We're gonna figure that out together. And then it came with these little clips, which is, I'm assuming, how you attach it to your phone. Then it also came with some instructions, both in English and in Spanish. So my tax zoom set includes the telephoto lens, the macro lens, the fisheye lens, a large universal clamp, a small universal clamp, and four lens covers. Okay, so I'm going to install my tax zoom for you guys like so. So I'm going to remove my case from my phone. It says to remove the lens cover. So you just twist it off like that. And then I'm going to use the large clamp. So you just want to clip it like so, and you wanna make sure that your cam your phone camera can be seen through the hole. And then, so you squeeze the clamp and place over the phone lens. Note, small ca clamp can only be used with fisheye and macro lens, large can't be, can only be used with the telephoto lens. So you wanna use the large clamp for the telephoto and the small clamp for the macro and fisheye and we will test all of these out together don't you worry and so then I believe you just screw your desired lens into Your phone in camera mode, turn the focusing ring until you see a clear picture. So we're gonna take off this part. And then this also rotates to focus, just like a real camera. And then you just, it just says to use your phone camera as usual. So um, note for telephoto lens, due to the properties of a telephoto lens, some of the image, image might be distorted. Once you zoom in using your phone, the distortion will disappear. So we're gonna go and test this for ourselves. So I'm putting on my tack zoom and um, I was inside at this point, so it was really hard to see where like the camera was focusing. Um, so it's definitely easier to view what you're doing with the tack zoom telephoto lens outside. So I took it outside and I was struggling a little bit to get it in the right position. But once I did, I focused it. As you can see, there's like a little black spot and that's just because it was out of focus. And then as soon as it was in focus, it went away. And I was, I have a great view of the New York City skyline. So I went out, out there and I snapped a couple pics. Um, it's definitely pretty clear, the photos. And they're obviously a lot more zoomed in than they would be with my regular lens. And then I found a plane in the sky and I got a good picture of that. And it's pretty clear for it being so far away. So that's it with the tack zoom. And then 
that's it without and you can't even see the plane. So it definitely does the job. Okay, so that was the telephoto lens. I'm gonna pop that back on, screw that off. I love that it comes with case like protectors because that is so nice. Now we're gonna try um, one of these lenses. So it came with two. Like I said, one is the fisheye and one of, is the wide angle. I don't, I'm not sure which one is which, but we'll find out in just a second. So I'm gonna try this one first. This is like the larger one of the two. Just gonna pop that on, like so. Go ahead and screw that in. Ah. I find it easier to actually screw it onto the, the thing, the clip first, and then to put it on your phone, but that's just me. I think this is the fisheye. Yeah. Oh, cool. Does it do? No, obviously it wouldn't do my, f oh, I wonder if you can do your front camera. <gasps> oh my goodness, that is so cool. So this is the fisheye lens. It's, unless you're like really close, yeah, it says my lens may need cleaning. It's like kind of blurry, um, unless you get like super close. I also am not a huge fan of how you can like see the outline of the like clip. And so I'm going to unscrew that one. It does say fisheye lens right there. So last but not least, let's try the, I'm gonna screw this in first, macro lens. So this is gonna make like really wide shots. So if you wanna take like an Ellen selfie. So that's it with the wide lens on and that's it without. This one doesn't make a terrible amount of a difference. Um, yeah, I could, I don't know if I'd see myself using this one as much. I mean, it does a. It's not completely fisheye, because fisheye is 180. But this, like, you can definitely see like the door and like over there. Whereas if you take it off, you definitely can't. And I didn't move my phone at all, so it actually does kind of work. And then let's flip the camera around and see if it works on the front. So this is it with the wide angle on and this is it without. So yeah, it definitely does make a difference. I just don't see myself using this one as much. I guess if you wanted to take like selfies with like a large group of people, which is what the infomercial like suggested this one for. So overall, I am very impressed with this product. Um, it is very easy to install to your phone. It takes pretty decent quality photos um, and it's compact so I'm more willing to like take this and use my phone to take pictures than to lug around a like DSLR and like a bunch of different lenses because everyone's phones nowadays are such high quality but you still want those fancy lenses to get good shots and like get the fisheye and the wide angle whatever so now like I'm able to have both. I can have it compact, but also have really good quality and funky shots. My only complaint really is that like you'll see on the phone, like in the pictures, you can see like a distinct outline of like where the clamp is like from the circle. But I mean, you can add that as part of like the aesthetic, like you can edit it and maybe edit it out. I don't know. It's not that big of a deal, but your your photos are no longer really like square. They're more circle circular. But yeah, like I am very impressed with this product. I think it does exactly what it says it what it needs to do. Um, the zoom lens kind of was weird to like. You just had to get used to it. You had to like really line up the clamp to like where your camera is, and like it had to be like in a very specific spot without it like going too far left or too far right because if you do then it just throws the whole image off. So that one you have to be a little bit more precise with but the macro lens and the fisheye lens were super easy and while it did have like that circle around the photo um, 
you're able to just clamp it on and like take pictures and they look great. Um, the fisheye lens, the photos were a little bit more blurry, but that's because I think fisheye is meant to be like very close up for that crisp, crisp quality. But the wide lens, I thought I would dislike it the most, but I actually ended up liking it the most because it gives you like that edgy look and like it's funky and different, but the picture is still clear. Like the fisheye, it's just a little too weird and a little too out of focus for my liking, but that's just me. Um, some people love fisheye lens, so awesome. These are also incredibly easy to store and to clean. You can just toss them in like a little bag and then wipe it down with like, oh, nice dry cloth just to get the dust out of it but they do come with um, lens covers for all of them so I think that's really nice um, and then it also comes with one protector for the part that screws into the clamp. I wish it came with one for all three of them but it didn't um, so you just have to be careful with that. I can definitely see myself using it um, on a regular basis really. Like I said, they're so easy to just like toss in like a little plastic bag and then throw it in my purse and then I'm just like, ooh, like let's take a fun fisheye photo. Screw it on, it takes one minute and then you got a cool photo. Boom, done. Yeah, I am very happy with this product. I'm going to give it a five out of five stars. I highly recommend it. I'm so excited to use it now. I'm, I can, I'm already like thinking of like where I can bring it next to take like cool wide angle selfies or like fisheye photos of people or like extremely zoomed pictures. But that is all I have for today. If you liked this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel for more reviews on more As Seen on TV products. Also, make sure you check out tvstuffreviews.com for more products and more reviews. You can follow me personally at That Girl Claude's on all of my social media. It is always linked in the description. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you soon for another review. Bye.